<sighs> Damn, Q. Baby, you did that. You ain't <laughs> never been on E-Block, bitch. You too excited. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. You know what it is, man. The Live is Cloud Radio Show. On the planet. Earth, cuss. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show. What up, 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 though? You already know what it is, man. Mike was mute for for a second, but we, we good now. IG Live about to get that popping. What up, though? No matter where you're checking in at, don't forget you can pull up on the block, man. www.eblockradio.com. We back for another week, man. It's Monday. Monday motherfucking morning, man. Waiting on the gang to pull up. Of course, the gang ain't here, so I'm here by myself. We gonna have a fun show today, though, dog. Hopefully y'all checking in right now, dog. We playing uh one has got to go, dog. Go have a little fun this morning. Uh, go talk about a few things, man. Flooding out in Cali, go talk about a few things, dog. Uh, hopefully my my dogs and them pull up in a second, but uh, if they don't, we just go continue to have fun. <laughs> IG, what up, though? If you on IG live, though, just like I said, man, you pull up to the block www.eblockradio.com, dog. Pull up on the gang, see the whole. Studio view, which uh, right now is just me, so it's uh, it's all good. Hopefully <laughs> they'll be on their way, dog. Uh, let's see, uh, checking in over here. Oh, we got some people on Twitch, man. What up, though? Twitch in the building, man. And Twitch is normally for video gamers, but uh, we uh, we we uh, we over there too, though. Intellectually, uh, intellectually petty radio checking in, dog. What up, though, my nigga Jobs? Uh, actually, today was gonna be uh. The day we gave you a shout out anyway, so it's cool that you're checking in. Don't forget again, if you're on IG, man, go at www.eblockradio.com. Dog, see the full studio view on this lovely Monday morning, depending on where you at. Because you, if you're in Cali, dog, it's, uh, it's a lot of shit going on. So we ain't going to get into that right now, though. But uh, all right. I was trying to get a gang a second, dog. We're going to go ahead and get into it, man. Let's do it. Yo, yo, yo. You know what it is, man. The Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show, dog. And, of course, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the motherfucking 48205, man. Red Zone, baby. We in the building. Um, Let's get started right here, though. Of course, uh, as we do every Monday, dog, if you haven't been checking this out uh, for the past couple of weeks or the past three weeks, every Monday, dog, I want to give a shout-out to a Tubi movie because I, I fuck with Tubi heavy. So uh, this week. Let's uh let's go ahead and get into our two B movie Monday. Dude. Yeah, so two B movie Monday, dog. So this uh this week, dog, I'm a uh not not much of a throwback, but it's uh probably about a year or two old at this point, though. But uh gonna give a shout out to uh Micah and Jane, dog. So Micah and Jane is a kids movie, dog. Shout out to my dogs, Coke Horner. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Doing his thing, dog, for a uh, joint kids movie joint. What up, though? Uh, so yeah, Micah and Jane is the joint that we shouting out today, dog. Mike so you are, and Jane yeah, Micah and Jane. It is on Tubi, dog. Yep, for sure. Dog. Shout out to my man, Cole Corner and shit. This is a, a kids movie. Uh, if you watching it on Tubi, it's all good, though, because it's it looked like a, a a fucking Disney movie, dog. Like the shit is shit is fire, dog. So and of course, like most kids movies, uh. It's a lot of adult jokes in there too, so <laughs> you'll you have some fun with that, dog. So watch that shit with the kids. Uh, Tony Acorn checking out uh, Archon. I say Acorn. Tony Ar uh, Archon. I can't fucking talk, dog. Anyway, so that's my uh, to be uh, to <laughs> to be movie Monday, dog. Damn, can't get this shit together. I smelled weed and shit got nervous, I guess. I don't know. So the gang then pulled up. Uh, before they get seated and we started talking about what's uh, been going on all week, uh, we got one other segment to get to before we get started, dog. Let's go ahead and uh, spin the block. You already know what that is. We're going to go around the globe and give a shout out to another podcaster doing his thing, dog. So uh, let's jump into it. Spin the block, spin it one more time. All the way, all the way. Got the drop on you. Send that side. 
Uh, we spend a uh, we spend a block all the way to the land, dog. I don't know if niggas still call it the land, but uh, it's Cleveland. Uh, I don't know if niggas still call it that, but uh, we spending a block down to Cleveland, dog, by way of Detroit, though. Shout out to my man Jobs on the Intellectually Petty Radio Podcast, dog. Uh, shout out to my man's doing his thing. Actually had a chance to uh, to work with him last weekend or weekend before last, I guess, uh, on some projects, dog. So shout out to dog intellectually petty radio big make sure you cuz, big ups. make sure you follow him on ig and on youtube dog same uh you know same handle across the board uh yeah so shout out to my dog jobs doing this thing my money what's what's the deal with you dog? oh shit shit you know what i'm saying i'm keeping it low and flow <laughs> like a motherfucker is in ain't nothing wrong with that uh we got lighter in the joint <sighs> man somebody stole this shit i don't know what's yeah, man I don't know, I guess it happened last month and nigga shit. Can't keep shit. <laughs> Hell no, you know how that shit go, dog. But yeah, man, I ain't been doing shit, man. Like I said, I've been working and shit. Uh, I had a fire reunion this weekend. It was pretty lit. Oh, a bunch up? of delicious foods and shit, so. <laughs> that that was lit. Oh, uh, shit. Yeah, delicious uh, food is always lit. Definitely. So many different desserts. Oh, my God. And did God. you have to actually cook? I made a lasagna, two oh, pans okay. of lasagna. Oh, yeah, it ain't too bad, then. No, no. Yeah. As long as you had to cook all the shit, yeah, you have a exactly, chance to enjoy it. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, for exactly, sure. Exactly. That's what I'm about to do. And, and then, you know, after this shit, I'm going to KOA the de- uh, tomorrow. No word? Oh, that's this week? Yeah, that's this week. You know Damn. Saying? Yeah, hmm. sure. <laughs> Thought it was next week. <laughs> no, it was this week. You know what I mean? How long y'all staying? Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Oh, okay. All right, bet I'll be up there on Thursday. Dog. Nigga, that's the day we clock it. Get out of there. Right. We are, are leaving in the morning. Probably in the late afternoon. You ain't yeah. Stop, I'm the... coming Thursday morning. Then I'm coming for I'm coming up. for breakfast, nigga. Shut the fuck up. Nah, that's not gonna work. Yeah, no. All right, we we'll fuck it up. I tried it. And now you ain't trying shit. All right, maybe Wednesday then. Wednesday is the day we're gonna be there all day. So that's a good bet. Day. It's the day I'm pulling up then. And I ain't spending the night. I'm staying all day, get drunk, wasted, take a shit in everybody's cabin, and then leave. Well, that's what you're supposed to do. That's what, <laughs> that's what, my, ma- that's what my mammy do. Word. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly what my mammy do. She ain't staying the night. Nah, no, for real? Hell no. Oh, damn. I ain't know shit. Niggas don't be, they don't be liking to spend the night out there? Well, I mean, she's the, we done did it for fuck about 20 years. True that. True that. True that. I feel that. You know what I mean? So y'all niggas be in like real cabins or y'all be like in the ones with bathrooms and shit? Or you got the ones you got to go outside? No, we be in the ones with bathrooms. Oh, okay. They got them other bitches though. Huh? I know. I know. And, and we started off with those. Yeah. And then we like, fuck that. We need bathrooms. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> so we got the big ones now. So we yeah. get the big ones. Oh, okay. Yeah, nigga. To, you, you, for real. You need to come check it out though, for real. For real. I know. Because it, it's Low a nice key, look. probably ain't even that far from where I'm at. No, it's away. not. By, by, tw- by 15 minutes. By 15, maybe 20, 20 minutes. minutes yeah. yeah, for sure. I figured. I yeah. could go check yeah, that shit yeah. out. Come check it head. out. Come check it out, for real. For yeah, real. for a few hours or some yeah, shit. Yeah. yeah. Right. Cause Bring it, something. Bump, bump. I'm making burger dogs. What the who? Burger dogs. What the fuck is a burger dog? Burger dogs. Hey, man. You know what that is? Yeah, I think I do. Oh, no, okay. It's a burger and a hot dog together, nigga, on a bun. So, I mean, like, it's a actual hot dog? Ain't no hamburger together. <laughs> so, it's a chili dog? No. <laughs> it's a hamburger. Like so, that. like, you putting a... I mean, you got to grind the burger up, though, right? It's a burger already grind up. The right, that's what I'm saying. So, it's already grind, so I'm just putting it in, in the middle of the hot dog. In the middle of the hot dog? Yeah. What the fuck? I don't, I don't think I'm straight on that though. Okay, you you straight now. I mean, so it's gonna be made like a chili dog though. No, basically. it's gonna be on a hamburger bun, bro. It's oh, it's gonna be on a hamburger yeah. bun. Yes. <laughs> it's gonna be a, a hot dog on a hamburger bun. It's gonna be hamburger in the. Man, what are you listening? <laughs> Is you fucking listening? Is it gonna be hamburger in the in the? It's gonna be hot dog in the hamburger or hamburger in the hot dog? It's gonna be. Hamburger in the hot dog, bro. Right, so if it's hamburger in the hot dog, how the fuck did you put the hot dog on the hamburger you bun? Just come find out, figure, find out, man. Just come fucking find out, bro. You niggas is confusing me, bro. No, you confused. Not confused. I'm saying, like, if it's a whole ass hot dog, how is it getting on a hamburger bun? Because it's gonna be split in half, uh-huh. and then I'm gonna patty the fucking hamburger meat in the motherfucking that piece shit sounds that's split disgusting. in half, and I'm gonna grill that bitch. It's gonna be a hamburger hot that dog. That shit sounds disgusting. A hot? Is it gonna be like a beef sausage or a hot beef, dog? Beef, beef dog. Man. That shit sounds disgusting. Hey, you eat that shit? Probably. A hot dog hamburger. 
A hamburger hot dog, whatever but the fuck you, you know what? The thing that shit sounds disgusting. It, it, it does, but, you know, I, I can't go against what Monk cooked. He I never, guess when a nigga say hot dog, it just, it, it, it disgusts me. Like, a nigga, I ain't eat no hot dogs, I, I mean, guess. the nigga ain't never cooked nothing nasty, so. Yeah, shit sounds terrible, though. <laughs> but he ain't never cooked nothing nasty. Yeah, it would be a difference if it was somebody I didn't know Yeah, that shit. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure he made a way for that shit to taste good. I suppose, but the nigga ain't never cooked no man. Hundred percent is gonna be fine. Yeah, all right, I'll take your word for it, though. Mm, I'm gonna show you, but I can tell. You. <laughs> I bet, uh, son. Liberty said, "I feel like I don't even know you guys anymore." <laughs> <laughs> Go back to three days or two days and do a show at night or something. <laughs> That's it's what's only, up. It only be a week in between, though. We appreciate the love. That's though. what's up. I know, right? Um, Angry Man shit, what's been popping with you, dog? Been a little weak and shit, dog. What's popping? I hey. you know you've been watching that shit. Um, what is it? Um, what's the name of that shit? Uh, Supernatural. Yeah, yeah, Supernatural shit. Yeah. You, yeah. you fucking with that? Yeah, you know, sometimes, like, we, I said it before, it mm. get good, and sometimes it's like you eating wood french fries or some shit sometimes. <laughs> or eating hamburger dogs. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I, I'm anxious to try it. I want to try it. Right. I might make, look, I might seriously make the trip just to taste, just to see that shit. Yeah, I want to try it. Fucking hamburger hot dog. Like I said, the nigga ain't never made nothing nasty, so. I'm just, I just don't anticipate that shit being good. You So, obviously, you've done this before, I guess. For sure. Hamburger hot dog. Anyway, what else been going on with you, Doug? I know, I can't call it. Yeah. I'm working sure. like a motherfucking Hebrew slave. That's about it. Yeah, niggas got family out in L.A., man. Everything good? Uh, no. Because um, uh, that BB. bitch flooding and tornadoing and shit. Yeah, B.B. sent me a picture of it. it. It didn't look good. Yeah, it's going crazy out there, motherfucker, dog. Yeah, it didn't look good. Them niggas can't catch a break. I mean, at least some of the fires will get put out, I guess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that, I don't know. If that's, yeah, I probably shouldn't laugh at that. No, it might help it spread. You know, with the wind. With and the wind, the, yeah. It might carry that shit. Man, he ain't bullshit. There's enough just, water on that motherfucker to put some like, of that shit Just out. like it did Hawaii. They had a fire fucking tornado. They treating mm -hmm. Hawaii like that bitch ain't a part of the United States, nigga. Man. They fooling. Oh, you know, it's it's is, tough here. Is Canada still on fire? Shit, probably so. They got air quality fucked up every day. I don't know if it's because of them or us, nigga. I don't know. Well, the, the world. <laughs> the world's fire. fucked up. Yeah, the whole Think world on fire. Man, on east side, that was the west coast on fire. On the other side, that was Canada mm -hmm. on fire. Nigga, yeah. Some, we need to start thinking about that shit. There's a lot of shit on fire, huh? Yeah, the world's on fire. Glaciers melting and shit. Yeah. Well, Notre Dame's predicted that shit, too. Oh, God, here we go. Notre Dame. Well, hey, we did. Yeah, yeah, I got you. You got a lighter? I do not. And I looked at the motherfucker when I left the house, too. And we had one. We had a studio like us. I'm about to bring four of this bitch. Nah, it you don't just, matter. You going to take all four of them, bitch. Just nail that bitch to the, uh, <laughs> to the bar or some shit. Right. Got to put that shit on the stream. But no, nah, like, I mean, but I'm, I'm, I mean, it's funny, but it ain't funny, but he did predict it. Yeah. And, and I was talking to a co-worker. I'm like, but mm -hmm. it's... That's probably only one of the things that I do believe in, because he everything he's predicted has came true. Yeah, I mean he's got a, like a ninety percent rate of predictions. So. <clears throat> so you know what I'm gonna say about that shit though. Now, and, and, and you talking to a nigga who who fuck with you know aliens and all kind of shit, right? But the thing about Notre Dame is, I I just feel like the way the world works and how shit is ba basically cyclical, like everything happens over and over at some point. I mean, at some point, the shit he's saying is going to be right. <laughs> That's yeah. all I'm saying. At some point, the shit he's saying is going to happen. I mean, but he, so named, that, he named names, though. Well, not names, but, you know, brothers uh, going to be in power that's going to get assassinated. And, and that has been happening since the beginning of the time, nigga. So, like, and that's all I'm saying. Like, He named one name, though. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, I, now that I didn't know. Because, yeah, when you're talking about situations and circumstances, and, and, like, those shits and don't happen. And that's the only reason why, you know, I was like, damn, he did name one name. Oh, okay. Uh, but he pronounced it differently. Oh, okay. And that was Hitler. Yeah. He pronounced it Hitler. Yeah. He did pronounce that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, and then he said, how the, how's the world going to end? Did, did you hear that prediction? Nah, what's the, what's the prediction on that? Man made fire from the sky. And this bitch is on fire. Nah, nigga, come on. They say that shit in the Bible. <laughs> so, like, I mean, again, shit like that, it, I mean, it's, it's bound to happen and shit. I mean, obviously. How is it bound? Because the last time this bitch blew up from fire in the sky, nigga. So, what the fuck? Okay. What, what you saying? Okay, well. Yeah, <laughs> right, so this shit. It. Huh? 
We didn't know it was going to happen again. You can't say you just knew it was going to happen again. I mean, you don't know it's going to happen, but the probability of it happening is is, is probably likely because shit, shit that happened before is going to happen again. Like, that's just, it, again, shit around this bitch is cyclical. Shit happened and then it happened again later on, nigga. So at was? some point, at some point, the nigga going to be right. Spell cyclical. What was that word you used? Cyclical. Spell it. C Y C L I C A L. Motherfucking slick. Cyclical. <laughs> damn it. But he can't say it. I think I was spelling be <laughs> spelling be champion of the motherfucking world, nigga. Well, mm-hmm. oh, no, nah, just just the school. But I, I didn't <laughs> I didn't make it to the to the other shit. No, you see, you know why? And then we gonna get to the for real topic now. You know why I didn't make it to the. Uh, to the districts though for uh for spelling bee shit though. Cause I spelled uh Olympics without saying capital O nigga. What? Yeah, they put me out there, motherfucker. Though. That's the weakest shit ever. So you gotta capitalize the O or it don't count or it don't count. That's retarded. Yeah, I know, fucking. Anyway, whatever though. I fuck the niggas. <laughs> Shout out to uh Lynch Annex. Lynch Annex. <laughs> I was almost uh, spelling be champion of the world, nigga. World I probably... <laughs> no, but you, you know you've been fat for a long time, though. When you do a spelling bee and your word is sandwich and niggas start chuckling. <laughs> you know you've been fat for a long time, right? <laughs> <laughs> say, and your word is sandwich, niggas. niggas. Yeah, nigga, fuck fuck y'all. Like, why did they give him that word? Fuck y'all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas weak as hell, bro. That one with the whole green. That nigga fuck around spell the same as Ashley. T U R K E Y B L T. I just, like, I really thought about that shit years later, though. Like, why the fuck was niggas chuckling when they said sandwich and shit, dog? That's it. It's fucked up, dog. Nigga fuck around and spell Big Mac out in that motherfucker. I remember the motherfucker making DLTs. Yeah. Thought that shit was terrible. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Um, I remember the, when Big Max was two for five, nigga. Dog, what? I remember when the motherfucker uh, combo was two ninety nine. I remember you can get one of them bitches for 99 cents, nigga. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the man of Whoppers. I was in high school. Motherfucking Whoppers. Yeah, yeah. Buy remember, one, get one free and shit. Remember the big boy? Well, the big boy ain't nothing but a Big Mac. That's yeah, that. I ain't never really fuck with uh, I never fuck with big boys like that. Oh man, I used to love that joint. Man. Yeah, cause it really wasn't shit. What well, other than the one down on Jefferson, shit really wasn't. I remember when one on this nigga, this hey, nigga, here you go with this shit. I remember you old one boy. On the street nigga, that nigga say it was one on Connors. I do not remember that shit. A uh, big boy across the street from the uh, airport. Yeah. Nigga. Right where well, uh, you know, I what, remember. I remember. You know where that auto shop is? Uh-huh. That's that's where it used to be. Yep. And y'all was around when that bitch was operating. Like, it was open or it just had the sign out there and it uh, used to nigga, be there. We used to, my, me and my mom and my sister used to walk down to that I bitch every never, Saturday. I, 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 can't, I do not remember that That's shit. That's man. I mean, yeah, of course he know. He old, nigga. So you denying that it was there? I'm no, I'm not, that, I'm not denying it was there. I'm just saying, like, I don't remember it being there. No, and even if I did you, see it there, you wouldn't remember. I think, I think that I half ass remember the big boy shit still being there. I remember yeah. that too. But yeah. I don't remember it the, the, being I, in operation. It being functional. Yeah, no, like going in that bitch order. I don't, I don't yeah. either. No, I do. I do. Trust me. I do. I don't remember being that bitch operation. Yeah, I do think I do re- I do you, remember, you, you the, remember yeah. the sign because the sign was there for I remember the sign. Yeah, I remember the sign yeah. now. Yeah. <coughs> but was, big boy was out here like McDonald's for a minute. Because you yeah. got to remember one thing. <coughs> the reason why it was cranking the way it was. Shit. And that's because of the airport. The airport was banging at that time. Right. Niggas was taking real flights out that bitch. And then and you remember the hotel? Shit. The hotel? That hotel used to bang back then. Mm-hmm. Oh, on the, on the corners? The yeah. airport motel? Yeah. <laughs> the, the, the Snooty Fox and shit? No, the Snooty Fox. That motherfucker down the street still doing numbers, though. That bitch down on Connors by the, uh, by the freeway? Oh, yeah. They, 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 they can live in that bitch, bitch though. Yeah. You know? Those apartments, nigga. They yeah, basically. Hotel, yeah, you're right, though. I feel you, man. And All right, now I didn't choke. <coughs> oh, shit. That little house across the street, that's where the pilots used to live. Yeah. We'll stay overnight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all remember you had told me that shit before, though. Uh, shit, what time is it, though? It's time to. Yeah, oh, shit, it's after 10 30 for sure. All right, so we uh we fucking around today, though. We go play a few games and shit, though. You know, we like to do this, though. And we gonna play uh One Has Got to Go, though. I got some interesting ones. I got one on here that I know uh, Angry Man might like and shit. 
Uh, we gonna start with uh, let's see where we want to start. Uh, let me see. Let's pull up some shit. Let's start with some video game shit, dog. One has got to go, dog. We gonna start here, man. We go. We go a throwback on the video game shit, though. So we gonna talk about the Xbox, the original Xbox, though. The, the old, the throwback Xbox. Uh, Super Nintendo, the Sega Genesis. Or the Sony PlayStation. We're talking about PlayStation 1, of course. We're talking about the throwback video games. One of those got to go. The Xbox, Super Nintendo, Genesis, or PlayStation, dog. Which one you say got to go, bro? Angry Man, we'll start with you. Sure, dog. Name them again. Xbox, Super Nintendo. Super Nintendo. Damn. Damn. <laughs> you don't fuck with the Super Nintendo, nigga? No, out of there. Damn. <laughs> That's crazy. That nigga Bo said he remember that shit though. Yeah, I mm -hmm. forgot he used to stay in the hood and shit. Uh, let me see. Dre said Genesis. So let me say all Xboxes is garbage. I don't know about that one. Though. I mean, I mean, shit, man. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go with Genesis because shit, Xbox. I mean, I will. I was gonna say Xbox, but I've yeah. never played a Genesis. You know what I'm saying? So Duh, why maybe, I maybe I have. But yeah. I don't remember it, so that's that's, that's, that's <laughs> a big ass controller. That's yeah, one, of, controller. one of the things I had to fucking you know get rid of because yeah. I fucking uh, Super Nintendo. What's that? That is yeah, yeah. That bitch had the fucking 007 on it, and I I was playing that religious. My whole family was playing that religious. Yeah, that was on. That was yeah. on Genesis too. No, it was it. 007 yep. was on fucking N64. What? It was on Genesis too. No, it wasn't. Hold on, what? Because I used to play Super it. Super Nintendo? No, nah, nigga. Yeah. 007 didn't come out till... 007 was on fucking this fucking... I think it was with on... The purple that bitch was on the N64, nigga. No, I think it was on... That newer them. Nintendo with the big ass no. re remote that looked like a claw. No. I think it was on all of them. Because I played 007? it on... 007? Yeah, I played it on in college. I, cause that's the only thing I had was the fucking Genesis. Right, we played it on, in college too, but I thought it was the N64. I'm tripping. I might be fucked up. Yeah, I don't know. I might be fucked up. I can't play that shit now, though. That shit make me nauseous. Yeah. <laughs> Call of Duty fucked me up, too. Yeah, that's what I thought. Son of Liberty said, no, it's just N64. I thought so. No. Yes, yeah. nigga. That bitch looked like a Super Nintendo. It was the, it was the newer Nintendo. It was the on, N64, it, nigga. It was on more video, uh, video games. No, nah, that bitch was an exclusive, nigga. I'm telling you. Bro, I'm telling you. Golden Eye. Golden Eye was exclusive to N64, bro. I know I ain't tripping. Yeah, Nintendo 64, that was it. Okay. Y'all niggas tripping, dog. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hey, somebody else hit me in the comment box because every nigga, every nigga who went to, who, who been to college and shit between 90, what, 95 and fucking 2001 played, Double, definitely played 007, 007 on N64, nigga. Yeah, I think it was N64. Yeah. And, and, it, and if it was, all right, he might be right. He said if it, Again, right, I agree. If it was a Bond game, it wasn't It wasn't GoldenEye, nigga. GoldenEye was the shit where yeah. niggas really... Nigga, that was N64, nigga. Yeah, okay, but I, oh, you might be right on that, but I know I played that bitch on the Genesis. Mm -hmm. You know what? It was because N64 had four play, four, yeah. four controls. Yeah, four control. yeah. yeah, that was it. And none yeah. of these got the four controls. You That's why right. I said it was on more than one system. Yeah. Not that golden no, 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 like eye, <laughs> Golden eye was exclusive, nigga. Exclusive, Hell yeah. Shout out to golden eye, man. I got niggas through a lot of college years and shit. Not going to class and shit. Like, niggas skipping school. Shit crazy, dog. I skipped school for for uh, golden eye and fucking, uh, what's that shit? Uh, what's the nigga that died? Jerry Springer, nigga. That's, yeah, I skipped school for <laughs> Jerry Springer. Nah, no, don't Fuck with Jerry Springer. The only thing that kept me out there, bitch, video game wise, was mm -hmm. when, uh, when the dorm had the motherfucking uh, football tournaments. Yeah. Oh, playing Madden and shit? No, we, uh, how we did it, we had the college and Madden. Mm -hmm. And we had it where, you know, you could draft from college, you know, to your Madden team and shit. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. Okay. So, nigga, if it was your turn to play, nigga, you had to go play. All right, well, shit. Let's, uh, let's talk about this. Since we talking about that shit, let's go to the next motherfucking dog. This for all y'all throwback. So all y'all throwback football uh, video game niggas and shit. If y'all under forty and shit, y'all might not understand where I'm coming from. So here we go, dog. Bill Walsh, college football, dog. Joe Montana Sports Talk, the original John Madden football before it was NFL. It was just John Madden football and Tech Mobile, dog. Which, Which one? one of them folk gotta get the fuck on? Bill Walsh, that was the original college football nigga. Joe Montana Sports Talk. 
J- uh, John Madden or Tecmo Bowl? I'll probably get rid of Bill Walsh. 100%. Work. Mm. 100%, 100% Bill Walsh. I don't know, dog. I, don't fuck, I ain't, ain't going to lie to you. I'm getting rid of Joe. What? Joe? Joe was too fucking hard to play. It was too hard to play, bro. Yeah. Like, that was the first time when they, they really gave you too much control. Mm-mm. Like nigga, you got you really got to catch the motherfucking ball with the receiver and shit. Remember they put the little spotlight. They were the first niggas doing the spotlight, nigga, where you could throw this bitch to a spot and not the person. Nigga, the first that shit sport, was too hard to control. Was the first sports talk game, nigga. Yeah, and that shit was too hard to play. It's a beautiful day here in San Francisco, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga, comment, commentators dry as fuck. Dry as fuck. Thank you, dog. Damn, son, we were agreeing on some shit, though. He said Joe Montana was garbage. It it was garbage. It was just different, but it was garbage. I'm 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 doing Joe Montana. I gotta get rid of that yeah, shit. If, if you complaining about how it is now, how mm-hmm. do you play it today? Shit. I it's mean, what well, you ex- you expect it now though, because you've been groomed and shit. That the first time. Well, how it, did you get groomed by playing Joe Montana? Exactly, but that don't mean I gotta like it. <laughs> I I ain't fuck with Bill Walsh. I didn't even know that game was out existed. The only reason I know about Bill Walsh is because, um, shout out to my nigga Kodak Lee and shit. Uh, it would take six hours to get a haircut and shit. So while you was waiting to get your haircut, niggas was playing Bill Walsh. <laughs> That's how I got a hip to that shit, dog. Niggas try to get a haircut at one, finally get in the chair about seven thirty. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> shit. By that time, niggas be high and shit. Niggas cut your hair off. You got to go to school with a ball head and shit. But whatever. And you don't want to bring up old shit. Hopefully, you get that bitch cut before nine. Yeah. <laughs> Just because you're in the chair don't mean you about to get that bitch cut. Exactly. Because at 830, mom's going to send them to Perry Drugs <laughs> to go get some shit. And Blockbuster. And Blockbuster. <laughs> Fucking Perry Drugs. We old as hell, bro. That shit crazy as hell. All right, let's, uh, <laughs> let's get to some more. Though. So you said... Uh, both of y'all say Bill Walsh. Mm-hmm. I say Joe Montana, dog. That shit was uh, that shit was kind of trash. You know you got to keep Tech with Bow though. Even the even the whole ass uh, John Madden shit. Even though it's the one that before they started actually giving niggas NFL names and shit. That's cool. Um, let's see. Let's kind of let's keep let's keep fucking around with the football shit though. I thought this one was gonna be hard, dog. So I'm about to throw this one out here, dog. Shout out to Chantel checking in. What up, dog? Don't forget if you're on IG Live right now, man, you can hit us in the uh, on the block at www.eblockradio.com to see the full studio view. All right, we're going quarterbacks with this one, dog. All right, y'all niggas ready for this shit? Let's go. John Elway, Peyton Manning, Tom Brady, motherfucking Patrick Mahomes, dog. Which one got to go, dog? John Elway, Peyton Manning, TB, nigga, you know, motherfucker TB, Patrick Mahomes, uh, which one got to go? That should be a tough one. That is. It a was tough a tough one for me. It ain't but tough I'm, for me. It ain't tough for you? Dude. Who are you choosing? Elway. Who, 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 who got to go? Yeah. Patrick. What? Yeah, out of that four, Patrick got What? I can live with that. You said Patrick Mahomes? What? Yeah, I can live with that. Wow. No Patty Mahomes. Okay, yeah, I, can live, I can live with that. Damn. That's damn. Dre that. said the same thing. Dre said Pat. I can live with Patrick Fuck. Mahomes, bro. So let me say Elway. You say Elway too, Monk. Yeah. Right? I'm a, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I'm fucking I'm, I'm gonna say Elway too. Yeah. I mean Elway cold. But, but if I gotta if I gotta don't only, miss the rest ahead, of the motherfuckers, go ahead. No, the only reason why I say that uh-huh. is because you look at the look at the longevity of the people you have in this circle. Yeah, Patrick had immediate success, but is he going to have longevity? Elway played in what six Super Bowls. Mm-hmm. Look at what Manning did. Look at what TB did. I'm just saying, if I got to choose somebody that has to go, and I'm not chucking this talent, yeah. the motherfucker's cold. Duh, cold blooded. But this is a hard <laughs> list to choose from. It is. But you know, I'm saying if I'm Damn. A, if I'm a pick one, Tom, Patrick, shout out to my man Tony the Barber. Though. This nigga said pay Manny. Oh no. What? I didn't see that one coming at all. I didn't think nobody oh, choose no. either one of them motherfuckers. Yeah, no. Pay Manny? Not Peyton. What? I mean, man. but you get what I'm saying though. Yeah. Patrick is cold. But yeah. that's you saying he ain't been around long. Yeah, enough. that's a Tall mountain to climb. His resume ain't long enough in comparison. Yeah, I got you. That's a tall mountain to climb between the three. I can do that, I guess. If he around on that list and we do the list again Mm -hmm. five years later, oh, Pat Stan. (laughs) He said five years later, right? And he's still having success he's having. You know what I'm saying? Oh, he's staying, definitely. He said that boy trash in the playoffs. Talking about Peyton Manning. 
Man, I just can't. He's surgical with that vision. And you know what? I, I, I got I to say this too, though. He plays some hell of a defenses in the goddamn playoffs. Man. I got to say this too. I, I watched... You know, I, I watched Peyton Manning and shit, and and again, like like you always say, like when niggas when niggas play football and shit, like you look at the game a, a little bit different and shit. Um, and I know it was just the Lions and shit, right? But it was you know it was the year that he was breaking Johnny United shit, and we had a chance to see the nigga at Ford Field. Oh man, that was beautiful. Seeing that motherfucker on TV and seeing it with your eyes. That nigga is amazing, bro. Like I, I ain't trying to be on the dick like that, but I'm just saying, like you see, it, you see it in in, in person, bro. That, that, yeah. yeah, that nigga's amazing. He said he's a great regular season quarterback. Nah, I, I still say, it. And like mm-hmm. I said, it, and this and and it's, I don't want everybody to think I'm retarded when it comes to football because I'm absolutely not. Yeah. It's just that I, Patrick Mahone on that list. On that list. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I, I hate to do it, but yeah. shit. Dude. I'm going with Elway, uh, <laughs> Peyton, and Tom Brady. You know, so let me say, Burline had longevity, but he sucked. Yeah, <laughs> right. Trey Denver got a Super Bowl. <laughs> that Steve the Bird, man, is he still in the league? <laughs> Steve the Bird. Uh, that nigga, oh, well, never mind. I was gonna say the nigga probably dead. I don't want to say that because like, because a lot yeah. of niggas been dead lately. So, uh, but no, like I said, when it come to that list, he said it, Pat it, Mahomes is better than all of them. I wouldn't say he's better than all of them. I say he's just more exciting right now. What? Why you wouldn't say he's better? Why? Why? Yeah, why you wouldn't say? He's just more exciting, right? I mean, like I said, because you know the longevity in it. He hasn't really, you know. I mean, I mean, stat wise, off the talent and stat wise, yeah. right now, nigga. Yeah, like I said, nobody can more, improvise like he's that. More, he's more exciting to watch. That mm-hmm. don't make him better. I mean, okay. Just because that's, that's more, what you say, cause exactly. just because you're more exciting to watch, don't make you better. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Because he ain't shit but a, a younger John Elway, to be honest with you. Nah, John Elway can't improvise like that. Shit. You must have watch the Broncos back when John was in his prime. There, there's no such, there's no such person who improvises like Pat Mahomes. There hasn't been and there probably won't be. <laughs> I couldn't say that because you've never seen every quarterback play. I've seen John Elway in his prime. And I'm telling you, it's pretty much the same fucking thing. There has been, there has not been, and probably won't be. <laughs> Have you ever seen John Elway play in his prime? Yes, I've seen him play in his prime. No, I mean before you was two. Have you ever seen Before John I was two, nigga, you nigga wasn't even that good. Okay, but did you see John <laughs> Elway? No, I'm just, I'm being honest with you. It's the same fucking thing. Yeah, yeah, so, so you Elway. trying to tell me that the Broncos who got their ass beat by the Redskins in the fucking Super Bowl is, 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 is can improvise as well as fucking... Uh, we're not talking about the team. We're talking about the two quarterbacks. John Elway and Patrick Mahomes is pretty much the same fucking quarterback, bro. Duh, how can you fix your mouth to say that? Just what I just said. Who, Damn. Who, who was the first running really, really Steve, the first? Steve Young, nigga. John was doing that shit before Steve not Young Not like did Steve it. Young. He did it before not Steve Young. Not like Steve Young. Young. You gotta remember, Steve Young came off the bench, huh? John Elway what came off What did that guy do today? John Elway did it first. And he was not... <sighs> All right, dog. You must not have watched a lot of Bronco games, man. How you going to make them comparisons, though? It's pre- pretty much the same fucking quarterback, dude. <laughs> Dog, John Elway and fucking... All right, guys, let's go to the next John, one. How many Super Bowls John Elway been to? We talking about... <clears throat> we talking about a nigga who... A nigga who dodged seven motherfuckers and, and throw a, a, a curveball or some shit. He bounced that bitch off the goalpost and, and let the nigga catch it. Like, come on, nigga. Come on. I'm this not, nigga be doing trickery with that I'm motherfucker. I'm not dog. saying he's not good, bro. That's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying he he's a very great quarterback. We we not talking about that no more. I'm talking about you making that comparison that he improvises as well as fucking John Elway has. Oh, yes. oh. I, I was a Bronco fan because of John Elway. Steve Atwater, man. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, now let's go to the next year. We'll be talking about football all fucking day, dog. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Tell him, boy. Tell him, boy. Tell him, he agree with you? Oh, the fuck up. I don't give a fuck what y'all talking about, nigga. <laughs> agree all you want, nigga. Good <laughs> fuck. This nigga's not a better improv- improviser. All right, so let's go to let's uh Let's stick with sports and shit for a minute, dog. Let's, uh, let's go to hoop shit, nigga. This one might be easy for y'all and shit, especially for niggas who don't like LeBron and shit. So, we going Magic, MJ, Kobe, and LeBron, dog. This is going to be easy for niggas who don't like LeBron, I'm sure. So, we got LeBron, motherfucking Magic Johnson, 
MJ, Black Mamba. You all going with that? This is easy. Yeah, I, I'm figuring for niggas that don't like LeBron. Yeah, LeBron off that <laughs> Right, I knew it was going to be easy for niggas like that. No, not, not not because, you know, I mean, LeBron is a hell of a guy, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Off the court, never got in trouble. You know, yeah. I'm just not a basketball fan of his. Yeah. You know, in comparison to this list, too. Oh, man. shit, what? This nigga Dre said MJ, bro. Me, too. Which MJ? What? Fuck. Hold on, wait, wait. Which right, y'all one? talking about Michael Jordan? Yeah, Which Michael, one? Michael Jordan. Wow, oh, y'all niggas tripping. Nah. nah. Fuck, y'all niggas get rid of Michael, fuck Jordan. Michael Jordan. Why? Cause we cause we from Detroit. Yeah. Wow, oh, niggas stop. Niggas oh, stop. Only only, re- only reason. Only reason why I said. it. Yeah, that's why Son of Liberty said he said it, cause he a Zeke fan. Y'all niggas crazy. I mean I mean, are we, you know, trying to build something here or are we just talking about just being a fan? Because if we talking about being a fan, whatever, whatever your, uh, you yeah. know, whatever your shit is, because why you would get rid of one, motherfuckers? I'm torn between two motherfuckers mm-hmm. on this list as my favorite basketball player, and I'm pretty sure y'all <laughs> know who those two are. So, Magic, Magic, and the Mamba. Yeah, one yeah, because you. I met Magic Johnson once before. Gotcha. And then the Black Mamba just because shit. Yeah. I, I I pretty if I had to pick one if you asking me to pick them in order if you asking me to pick them in order mm-hmm. I'll be picking the Black Mamba first yeah nothing yeah you know I mean <laughs> Dre said Jordan kissed my ass so I just man. just started buying the shoes <laughs> I, I did too I ain't gonna lie just start wearing them yeah Tony Barber said Kobe was my favorite so he ain't going nowhere. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, so I, I'm gonna say, you know, I ain't no hater and shit, but I, I'm gonna say LeBron out of out of those four and shit. I'm definitely gonna say how LeBron. I found out how John nigga said Jordan though, y'all fool. Yeah. Fuck Jordan. Damn. How the mama got number twenty four? Uh, hit me. I ain't sure. Yeah, I was uh, watching some shit, mm-hmm. you know, reading some shit, and they say he got twenty four because it was a uh, number above Michael Jordan. <laughs> oh shit! <word. laughs> nah, I didn't know that. Hell no, nah, that makes sense though. Uh, we got a we got a few more. Let me see, cause it's uh it's almost eleven, but we got a few more I want to go through that I thought was int- oh hold on, let's damn I ain't put that shit in here. Damn, I'm mad as it. No, there you go. Is that it? Yes, I'm sure angry man go love this one, dog. Let's do it, dog. Let's go to the motherfucking rap groups, dog. <laughs> what has got to motherfucking go? Here we go. I know you got some bullshit in here. Wu Tang. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't going nowhere, so I don't give a fuck who else you dip put up set, there. Dip set, dip set, NWA, motherfucker, G unit. Which one, dog? Dip set is out of there. What? Dip set was a whole motherfucking movement, nigga. Gone. They changed the world, nigga. Gone. Dip set was a whole movement, nigga. Gone. Come on, dog. Against that list of rap groups, gone. NWA, NWA ain't going Wu Tang, you know Wu ain't Dipset, and G. Dog, no, I would, I would get rid of. I don't know. Nope. Dipset got to get the fuck. <laughs> oh, y'all niggas tripping. Dipset, y'all niggas do just what they say. They got a Dipset. Y'all niggas tripping. Gotta dog. go, gotta motherfucker. Go. Just because I don't like the way Cameron flow. <laughs> Rudy Tooty, fresh and fruity, big old booty. Like, man, get the fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> Cash so both y'all... Make her lay. Like, man, what the fuck? So both of y'all going to dipset? Y'all, yeah, we can say it. In her face. Like, what yeah. the fuck? Damn, yeah. Dre said that shit too. Fuck y'all. Dipset gotta go. Fuck Dip y'all, y'all. Shit. I mean, obviously, looking at these four, y'all know which one gotta go. Yeah, I already know. You talking about Wu-Tang. <laughs> well, fucking Wu-Tang, nigga. Yeah, gotta get mind. the fuck off. Yeah, we got mm. your mind. Yeah, you That's crazy. revolutionary. Now, if it had just, if That's it had just said... That's revolutionary mm-hmm. right there. If it had just said mm-hmm. Raekwon and Ghostface, I'm like, right, they you can say. Think, but everybody else can get the fuck up. Over the Wu Tang? Yes, nigga. You what? Oh God, dog. Go back. Go 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 back over there with Too Short. So again, I'm not basing it. It just go back over there. Everybody with reasons what they reason is. My reason is Dipset influenced the culture, nigga. And that was a whole cultural movement. And Wu Tang didn't. Yeah, but not some shit I fuck with. <laughs> and Wu Tang didn't. That's some shit I fuck with. Yeah, that motherfucker Asian. Tony Barber said G Unit and shit. The whole Japan Wu-Tang. love yeah, Wu Tang. Wu Tang is in another. I was listening, <laughs> nigga. The whole Japan love that nigga. I was listening to G Unit today and showing the way over. Motherfucking uh, 
Nigga, the Get Rich to Die Trying soundtrack is classic, nigga. I was banging yeah. that shit on way over it, nigga. Man, I'm not shitting on the Dipset, but, like, again, that's a hard list. And if yeah. you gotta pick one, Dipset. Dipset? You gotta go. <laughs> Y'all weak as hell, dog. That bitch gotta go, nigga, because I, don't, nigga I just don't like the way Cam Flow, man. That nigga just. Cam Flow is crazy, cuz. Yeah, crazy shit. <laughs> Y'all look sweet, dog. All right, man, let's see. Uh, we got a, a few more. Where I wanna go? All right. I thought this one might be hard for real. I hit the wrong button and shit, though. We looking crazy on the screen. There we go. All right. So, I, I, I thought this one might be a hard one. Um, We going to switch it all the way up, dog. We going to comedians now, dog. If you're just now checking in, Gio Zan, what up, though? If you're just now checking in on IG, man, you can come up on the block on us, dog. www.eblockradio.com, dog. You can see the full studio view today. We playing. One has got to go, dog. We going to comedians, bro. Let's do it, dog. Motherfucking Bernie Mac, Chris Rock, Eddie Murphy, Richard Pryor, dog. It's easy for me. It's an easy one for you? Yeah. Damn, that was easy. Mm, 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 Richard Pryor, mm. Bernie Mac, Chris Rock, Eddie Murphy, dog. It's so easy for you, my money. What the fuck is it? Chris you? Rock got to get the fuck on. Damn. Mm. He got to get was the easy fuck for you? That was easy for me. Mm. Good. Because fucking for a long time, Chris Rock wasn't that funny to me. Damn, Tony the Barber said that shit too, though. Chris Rock. Damn, y'all niggas shitting on Chris. Damn, Gio's ass said Chris Rock too, damn. Chris Rock. Y'all don't fuck with Chris Rock, huh? Not like that. I ain't said nothing yet. Damn. I already know where I'm going. You know, it, Not with the Damn, Dre said that shit too, goddamn. Yeah, this, this, this is about to shock a lot of motherfuckers. This nigga gonna say Richard Pryor. Richard Pryor. You gotta what? The, I was just playing. You serious? Yeah. What? I, you got to tell me why on please, that one. I, please explain. I'm curious on that one. Explain. I, explain that one. Because I think Rock, Mac, and Eddie are funnier. <sighs> you got to be out your fucking mind. Uh, well, I guess you I'm talking fuck, about the creator, nigga. I'll fuck y'all all up then. I mean, I because I'm gonna say Eddie. What? I think. I think Eddie is. That's a shock to me, but yeah. hey, I, 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 I can say understand Eddie. your reasons, but like you know, but shit, you I say Eddie. Yeah, I say Eddie. Man, you gotta be out your fucking mind. I say Eddie, dude. I think Eddie, Eddie was stand up in the movie fucking collection that nigga got, bro. You got to be fucked. See, crazy. that's what I'm talking about. You talking about movies and shit. I ain't talking about movies. I'm talking about stand up, nigga. Delirious. Okay, you got two, and 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 go back and watch Delirious now. Raw Raw was better. Delirious wasn't as good. Go back and watch it now. It didn't stand the test of time, nigga. Man, it's funny. It didn't stand the test of time. Raw, raw is better than Delirious. You got to be out your mind, bro. Raw is way better than Delirious, bro. I mean, I give you that. Yeah, the one hundred percent. But yeah, so Delirious didn't. I dog no. And again, like for me, for me with Richard uh, Richard Pryor, it was just it was the evolution, nigga. Like if you see his his uh, beginning comedy and, and what he turned into being at the end and shit, it was just. Yeah, it's what I like. About it's what I like about Chris uh Chris Rock and it's what I like about Dave Chappelle. Like just they transparency and storytelling. You know what I'm saying? That's why I ain't like put cause like I fuck with Kevin Hart and shit, but like he just not mm. he not that kind of comedian for me. No, he no. couldn't be in the list. And I put <clears throat> I put Eddie Murphy in that group of it's funny, but it just it ain't it ain't that it ain't that one for me. It ain't that funny. What? It's not mm. that funny that I'm looking for. No, because see, see, he took a lot of shit from Richard Pryor, but not the shit that I liked. Not the not the storytelling, the shit that make you think type shit. You no, know what I'm saying? What it was you call that you you call Eddie at, at, at the end where he he, he where he actually said year year years ago he had to calm down his comedy because of his kids. <clears throat> his kids I mean, what were, you mean at the end? <clears throat> She's raw and delicious. The only shit that he got. <laughs> Exactly. So, so I mean, what you talking about? I mean, like I said, you caught it at the end. I caught it at the end. We didn't catch Eddie that the Eddie that I think that could have just ran through this shit mm -hmm. if he didn't decide to make that move for his family. Oh, you mean I, I, okay? I, yeah. yeah, I mean, but I caught it at the it's, end. It's nothing wrong with the evolution though. Like I said, because that was the same thing with uh, with uh, Man, Richard Pryor. Richard Pryor kept both going. Both y'all, y'all, both y'all crazy. <laughs> Chris Rock got to get the fuck off. <laughs> Yeah, my like dog man. Obviously not, dog. That nigga gotta get the fuck out of. We both crazy and shit, dog. All right, dog. Let's uh, let's wind it down a little bit, dog. Y'all, y'all choosing the makers of the shit. Uh -huh. <laughs> they made this. Where shit. we want to go with this shit, dog? Uh, let me see. Oh, we only ain't nobody said the Mac Man though. Oh no, nah, for sure not. 
We only yeah. got we only got two left. Actually, I guess we uh, we making good time because it's after eleven and shit. Uh, uh, let's go to movies, bro. Here we got hood movies, nigga. Hood classics. I probably know which ones y'all go. Which one y'all gonna say? I, I feel like I do and shit. So I, because of that, I think I might be surprised which one I'm gonna say. All right, let's do it, dog. Motherfucking paid in full. Menace to society. Boys in the hood. And juice. Which one got to go, dog? Paid in full. <sighs> Boys in the hood. Minister Society. And Juice. I feel like I know which one y'all gonna say. But Angry Man, what, what you say, bro? Well, all these are some motherfucking classics, man. For sure. For sure. All of them are some classics, but... This is harder than the last one. With this list here? <laughs> you weak as hell. <laughs> with this list right here... I know what you're going to say. Juice got to go. Oh, shit. Damn. No, nah, I wasn't... Okay. Word. Yeah. Juice? Mm -hmm. I really thought you were going to say paying the fool for real. I ain't going to lie. No, Juice well, got to go. I'm Juice, too. What? Juice yeah. got to go. This is too problems <sighs> overacting. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Right. If you look at the acting and shit wise, right? Uh all right, so let me see. Uh Tom said paid in full. Uh that's what I thought you was gonna say. Yo, both y'all niggas said juice. Dre said paid in full too. Y'all know I fuck with paid in full heavy dog. Me too, like I don't understand. That's why it's probably go fuck y'all up, dog. But if one got to go for me, bro. You know what I'm saying, boys in the hood. It's gonna be menace, bro. What? It's gonna be menace to society, dog. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie to you, dog. It's gonna be menace. Why are you dog, shitting me right now? Dog, because, like I said, I've always chosen Boys in the Hood over Menace to, to Society anyway, just because the the overall story. Like, Menace to Society was like, it, it's just, it's Tubi shit, nigga. I mean, in real life, it's classic, but it's Tubi shit, nigga. It's like the nigga, the nigga selling dope. Change his mind at the last minute, want to get out and get killed. Nigga, it's Tubi movie. It's, it's regular Tubi shit. Boys in the Hood gave you the scope of everything. The single dad, the motherfucker, the one nigga that chose the wrong path, the one nigga that, that chose the right path, the 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 relationships, it, it encompasses all of that shit. It's the same thing. It's not. Yes, it is. Where the, Where's the single father in, what you call it, in Mrs. Society? The grandfather. Yeah, he's a granddaddy. <laughs> he was raising his grandson. What's the same thing? Not really. Yeah, really. Not really. Yeah, really. But he wants single. I mean, but it, they were old. <laughs> Compare apples to oranges, nigga. They were old. Anyway, dog. So yeah, I, I, I mean, actually, I, I'm gonna choose this to say. But I, I, in my opinion, I think it's the same fucking thing. Yeah. Yeah, you know I mean, because mm -hmm. like he just said, Jada Pickett was a single mother in that motherfucker, mm -hmm. raising you know my man in the middle of the motherfucking fire. Um, Jay said the single mom is Jada. Yeah, no different than um, mm -hmm. you know, you talking about you know good people dying, shit, motherfucking um, Arif got murked. Then Stacy damn it. Wait, I'm saying all Stacey of Stacy moved on. All of these things are everything is in there. Stacy already he going to college playing ball and shit. Dog playing ball in high school. This nigga working at what's it Fox Hill Mall and shit. Yeah. This nigga selling dope. Kristen got shot robbing niggas and shit. Like everything is in there, not just the one site. It's and for the, me, same, for me, it? nigga, Mr. Society is just a, a dope boy motherfucking Tubi movie. It's the same. I fucking love it though. It's my shit. It's classic, but it's a. To me, if that bitch came out right now on Tubi, niggas would be talking shit about it. it be it, real. My thing is, eighties, nineties. Period. That's how I look at it. Boys in the Hood was the eighties. Minister Society was the nineties. I guess you don't look at it like that. That's look, how I look at it. Look, motherfucking two years ago, eighty nine and ninety one. <laughs> That's still eighties and nineties, nigga. All right, well, fuck it. I'm, 80s and 90s, I'm going with business to society, dog. That's my that's my shit right there, dog. It, 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 like I said, it just <laughs> it's just you know it, it transitioned. You know they showed you how it was in the 80s. Yeah. And they showed you how it was in the 90s out there in uh, in, in Cali. I feel. You. Yeah, it's popular overacting for me. You know, popular <laughs> overacting for me. Oh shit! It came out in '91. I'm tripping. So they both in the '90s then. Oh well. Mm -hmm. Well, or well. Late 80s. Yeah, I, was, I thought Same this shit came shit. out 89. I ain't gonna lie. Came out 91. All right. 
the check on us and shit, dog. You know, that nigga from there and shit, so. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> right. Yeah, I ain't mad at you. He from out there. You know when this shit came out. All right, dog. This is our last one, dog. And you know what it had to be. You know what the last one had to be because this is a conversation we always have, dog. So we're going to see uh, what niggas say on this. If you got a, uh, if you watching right now on IG, man, you can pull up on the block, eblockradio.com, dog. I see what we're talking about. I got one, too. You got one, go. too? Yeah. Well, what's yours, then? Let's do yours first. Netflix. <laughs> hey, look. Funny thing I thought about this, though. Oh, I just didn't add it on there. Go ahead. Netflix, Hulu, Tubi, Paramount. Oh, see, you already know that's easy for me. What? Hulu. Hulu? Hulu got to go because you figure on Hulu, most of the shit is coming on something else already anyway. The Hulu, the Hulu, uh, what you call them? Uh, the exclusive shit ain't as good as nothing else. Like the shit you watch on Hulu come from somewhere else, nigga. Nigga, all the shit you watch go on Hulu. But it's coming from somewhere else, so you ain't gotta have Hulu. Is what I'm saying. You watch the shit on Hulu, like you can watch fucking Snowfall on Hulu. That shit didn't come out on Hulu. It came out on FX. So you don't need Hulu. You can watch that shit on FX. Nah, so that's why Hulu got it. Can Hulu. get the fuck on. Hulu have all the shows you watch on that motherfucker. I'll, uh, yeah, from other places. So that means you don't have to have Hulu. It's Tubi for me. I knew he was gonna say Tubi. Y'all niggas crazy. <laughs> Tubi hey, is the Tubi shit. Tubi Hulu. has Tubi can't ever go nowhere, nigga. No, okay. So in case y'all just checking in, we don't have a graphic for this, but we doing uh, one has got to go, dog. So he said Netflix, Paramount Plus, Hulu, and Tubi, dog. For sure, for me, it's Hulu, dog. It's Hulu can Paramount. get the fuck out. Paramount got motherfucking... Uh, oh, yeah, definitely Paramount. I fuck with that. Because um, they got shit that's exclusive to, to Paramount, Paramount that you can't watch nowhere else. It, the, the exclusive shit on Hulu ain't shit. I don't want to see none of that shit. The other shit that you watch on Hulu come from somewhere else. So I can watch it somewhere else. I don't need Hulu. So that shit got to get the fuck on, cuz. You feel me? <laughs> that shit got the number of movies. Paramount got the number of movies, don't it? The number of movies. The fuck? Who? 1892 and... Yeah, yeah, so I know you can't get rid of that shit. Yeah, no. <laughs> the, uh, Yellowstone shit. Yellowstone shit. Jay said Paramount. I fuck with, I fuck with I Paramount, fuck though. I Paramount, too. Yeah. But yeah, Hulu can get the fuck on, dog. That shit ain't nothing but... It's, it's replay shit. And like I said, the exclusive Hulu shit ain't nothing worth buying Hulu. I'm just saying. I, I, ain't, I ain't putting nothing against Tubi. I ain't yes, you are, though. Because that's why you said that shit. That's the only reason you said that shit. You just want to shit on Tubi. They got fuck with Tubi, because... Hmm? Get rid of all that shit, man. <laughs> what you say, Anger, man? I said get rid of all that shit. <laughs> this nigga said get rid of all of it. Go back to 247, 20, and 50, <laughs> nigga. Hell no. Go back to some color television, man. Yes. Niggas don't watch TV anyway, for real, for real. There ain't shit on the motherfucker. But yeah, Hulu it. can definitely get the fuck on, dog, for sure. All right, let's get, to our, uh, let's get to our last one, dog. Then we gonna get up out of here, man. If you got a last minute comment, you can go ahead and throw it into the comment <clears> box. <throat> we'll read that motherfucker, maybe, probably, you know, some shit like that. All right, so you already know what it is, man. We got to go to the motherfucking sitcoms, dog. You know what it is. We got to end the shit with this all the time, dog. I shook it up a little bit, though. Tried to keep it in the tried to keep it in the 90s and shit. All right, so we got uh, the wife and kids. Martin, of course. Fresh Prince. And in Living Color. I think in Living Color is something I just threw in there to kind of mix it up a little bit. So, which one of them motherfuckers got to go, dog? Uh-huh. My wife and kids. In Living Color. Martin or Fresh Prince, dog. What say ye? <laughs> if you're watching right now, man, hit uh, us in the comment, dog. We want to know what y'all say, dog. Uh, One gotta go. Wife and kids yeah. in living color. Uh, Fresh Prince or Martin? It's not hard okay. for you. It ain't hard for you? What the mm-hmm. fuck? This is something. This shit easy for both of y'all? No, it's kind of hard for me. All right, this that's shit kind of hard for me. So I'm saying my wife and kids, dog. This Angry is- man, what you say? Living single. I say living color, nigga. Oh, living color. Oh yeah, they gone. <laughs> you, really? Yeah, boot. Hey, and you talk, and you talk shit about me getting rid of Eddie Murphy. Boot hey, you get rid of living color. Yeah, boot them motherfuckers. Get the, the fuck. Way. What? See, I first guess, of all, it wouldn't be no wife and kids if it wasn't no fucking living color. But my thing is, though, I, I really understand that that it was creators, bro. But I really didn't really get into you too? Living color I like that. Fuck Dog, living color like that. For the, real. Mm-hmm. Y'all niggas didn't watch Saturday Night Live, and y'all y'all not y'all don't fuck with skit shows like that. Yeah, I guess. Mm-hmm. Uh, not really. I'm not a oh, skit okay. show type. All right, well that's yeah, that's that do. Mm-hmm. It. So I they got to go. My nigga B. Ty said my wife and kids too. Damn, I did not. My wife and kids was funny. That shit was funny as hell to me. Junior, y'all remember Junior? 
Right, big head ass Junior and shit. Damn, Dre said the same thing. My wife and kids, damn, I ain't fuck with that shit. I watch that shit right now. Let's see, look at it. Damn, this um, you got Damon Wayans in two sets. You got Tisha Campbell in two sets. Like I just noticed that. Yeah. Like damn, but yeah, in living color. I mean, it it just wasn't that. It wasn't that for you. It it, it had its moments, but I could do without it. It was like one of the creators of the skit shit, though. I ain't gonna go and get twisted. It's like, you know, one of the creators, but I don't think that you know. I mean, it. Like my wife and kids was just funny as fuck to me. No, nah, for sure. Nah, you know, Prince. Fresh Prince. We can't. Yeah, even, you can't even do shit with that, that yeah. shit. <laughs> yeah, he damn sure ain't sure fucking with old Marty Mar. Nah, yeah. Marty <laughs> damn, y'all niggas got rid of the living color, dog. And as much as I love, I, I, cause I, I fuck with, I fuck with my wife and kids, dog. But I, I gotta, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of that one. If, if I gotta get rid of anything, mm-hmm. I, I can live without that shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I gotta have. I mean, granted, all of this shit wasn't hilarious, nigga. But like, in Living Color was just I, I, I fuck with skits. I, I like that shit. I guess I, I, I watched a lot of Saturday Night Live coming up. You know what I'm saying, Dan Aykroyd type shit. Like I, I like that shit. But you know, so, one of my favorite skits though, hmm. the nigga with the with the motherfucking guitar. <laughs> <laughs> like to hear song Thank you very go. much. <laughs> <laughs> right, V checking in. What up though? What's, What's up with you? Um, What's that, David Allen Green? Yeah, mm-hmm. he's he a funny nigga. motherfucker though. Oh, the song by I like to hear. Here you go. Yeah, yeah, he's a funny <laughs> motherfucker though. Yeah, mm-hmm. I don't think he get the. I don't think no. he get to just do. He's he he from should. here too, ain't he? For sure. Yeah. Yeah. He from the D. Um, that's it. Valentia. We had fun. Valentia. What's up, Valentia? That was fun and shit, though. We ain't did that in a while, though. I was thinking about that shit last night because I was I was watching something. I think Joe Button had did had did one. Like they did one thing and one guy to go. I was like, damn, we ain't did that in a while. Let's fuck around. So I put that shit together. Hope y'all had fun, dog. Uh shout out again to our Two B movie Monday selection. Uh that is what I what I say? <laughs> I think I had shit, dog. Uh, uh fucking yeah. Micah and Jane, dog. Mm-hmm. Micah and Jane for our Two B movie Monday selection. And our spin the block selection for a uh, podcast. Shout out to uh, intellectually petty radio podcast. Dog. Shout out to my man Jobs out in Cleveland. Uh, that was earlier on in the show. We gave him a shout out. Also, too, uh, shout out to Detroit Breakfast up here on Connor. Dog. I don't know if y'all been up to that joint yet. Black owned breakfast joint uh, right across from the Lear uh, plant out there now. Uh, good food. Good customer service, like good experience, though. So shout out to them. Actually, been uh talking to them that to see if we can do like a read for them, and people mention our podcast and can get ten percent out. We we uh we keep y'all posted on that. Been uh talking to them about that. So shout out to uh Detroit Breakfast right there on Connor South of Gratiot. That's about the only way I can explain it. <laughs> Going towards Chandler Park. I don't know. However y'all niggas want to get it, it's down there on Connor though. We'll put the information in, into the uh, description. That's it, though. Uh, what y'all niggas got going on, man? <laughs> something you want to... Something yeah. we got to tell somebody about? Uh-uh. When you coming back for another week and shit, so... <laughs> uh-uh. Shout out to my man, uh, Mr. Oh, yeah. Uh, getting uh, Monday night popping at Good Vibes Lounge on Harper Avenue. Right. Oh, I can't get the address right to Eric. Know. Nothing, dog. Good Vibes Lounge, dog. Y'all know where that shit at. Yeah, Go find that shit. I got something for y'all. Look up. Just look up. <laughs> Is a meteor coming again? Something. <laughs> this nigga, here we go, dog. There's something on this way. <laughs> oh, here we, here we go, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all preparing y'all for it. <laughs> earth on fire. Preparing this for it, bro. Look up. Earth look up. It's on fire, nigga. Look up. Oh, that note, dog. We about to be up out of here, dog. Make sure that you do like, share, and subscribe, dog. Uh, share with some people. Do all that good shit. And if you, uh, if you don't like watching all the time, you can actually listen to us everywhere. That they uh that they stream motherfucking podcast, hella heavy, in L A for some reason like I don't know we got over over ninety percent of our listeners the last 30, 30 days have been in L A shout out to y'all appreciate y'all right man. I don't know how that shit picked up like that but shout out to y'all niggas yeah, it's the love we'll yeah it's the love it. we love that shit dog we over here sea walking and shit right now you can't we see pray, me we praying for y'all too man dog for real shout oh, out man. to y'all niggas stay right, stay I'm dry about, I'm about to make a phone call in a minute. Uh, for sure. You all know, right. That's where my family is. So. Hell yeah. Shout out to all the people out in LA, man. Help y'all survive in the rains and floods and shit. On that note, dog, let's get up out of here. We're going to go around the block one last time. If you got a last minute comment, go ahead and throw it into the comment box. Angry man. What you want to leave the people with today, bro? I don't know. <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> what I will say, man, mm-hmm. is, you know, we joking about this shit, 
but it, it's, it's some shit about to go down. I mean, I don't know if it's biblical. I don't know if it's scientific. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Look up, <laughs> niggas. This, this, <laughs> this, this shit ain't right. Yeah, Man, look up. Something ain't cool, huh? You know what I'm saying? I mean, we burning on both ends. I don't think people realize that, you know? Mm-hmm. So me in the on, middle somewhere, you motherfuckers. It's on fire over here. I better get concerned. I better look up. Then you look on the other side of us on Canada, which is on the side of us, and halfway on the top of us is burning. Mm-hmm. This, this motherfucker on fire, man. <laughs> our people our people come to get us with the melanin. It's come, they come to get us. Get us <laughs> off this motherfucker. This, this motherfucker on fire. I think the only reason we cool because I think, you know, we halfway island, but Hawaii proved that that shit don't matter. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. Hawaii, if Hawaii's burning, nigga. Yeah, think about trouble. that. Yeah, we in trouble. That's a fucking island. They're surrounded <laughs> by water, and they can't put that shit out. <laughs> right. That is kind of fucked up, though, right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They can't put that shit out in Hawaii, nigga. <laughs> Hawaii? Just stick a hose in the ocean, nigga, and just let that bitch go. You Let's still... do something. Shit. Uh, yeah. Excuse me. Yeah, that was pretty fucking disgusting. <laughs> yeah, my <Yeah>. bad. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> that was pretty fucking disgusting. That's a big one. My bad. But no, nah, um, <laughs> but no, nah, um, but yeah, hey, man, just like, like he said, man, look up. We got to start paying attention, man. Yeah. And, you know, Kodak been telling us for a long time, get your perishables up, get your shit up, get mm. your canned goods together, nigga. Cause, uh, hey, nigga, I'm, if I didn't believe in, I believe not. Because, yeah. like I said, it, it's too much fire Sunday around us, man. Yeah, I mean, we can joke about this shit all day, but we got to mm. start paying attention and start preparing, man. Yeah. Or, or, or it's, it, it's going to get real. Yeah. Even if it don't happen, I just want to be prepared for it. Nah, I feel you on that shit. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, y'all, like like Monk said, look up, nigga. Look up. <laughs> Ain't that what Isaiah used to tell us when we was kids? Just oh, look shit, up. the power lines and shit. Yeah, 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 look up, nigga. Power lines. Fire. <laughs> look up, nigga. Nah, here we go, man. That's the diamonds and shit, right? Come on, buddy, dog. What you want to leave the people with, dog? <laughs> Niggas better look up. <laughs> I mean, I mean, That's like, it. Huh? I mean, this is what it is, bro. Y'all see yeah. what's going on? Like, like it's, it's shit is thrown in our face so much, bro. Just like everything else that we just look over. Yeah. We look over everything. We look over the fucking white people still don't liking us for no reason. We look over all that shit. We look over every fucking thing, bro. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And then when the nigga do get a piece of shit, some piece of money or something, that's only themselves. Yeah, they don't get back to the motherfucking hood. <laughs> they never do. They always say they do, but you know, turkey drives and all that shit. Exactly got, turkey drives. That shit. That shit. You got seven houses. <laughs> you got seven houses, millionaire boy. What the fuck you gonna do with seven houses? Boy. What are you gonna do with seven houses? Mm. Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like, Airbnb you know, numbers. I mean, come on. I mean, I, I mean, if you understand, you run your business like that, then okay, you got a business like that, okay. But I'm saying, you you a motherfucking millionaire, and you don't think you should help the next man or some or or provide a way for fucking helping the next man? Yeah. Hell no. We just put some jobs in there. <laughs> Sticking man, this shit got all serious. Like, like, this shit like, got all serious like, with like, the final like, sentiment. Like, like like Arab dudes, if you if if an Arab billionaire had a fucking factory and he's making whatever the fuck guess who working there niggas Arabs <laughs> Arabs no, they, they Arabs. Care, they Chinese ain't. have a motherfucker Chinese billionaire have a shop guess who working there Chinese it's just that's cause you don't wanna work for 950 black billionaire <laughs> you don't wanna work for 950 that's why you ain't in there that's why you ain't in there pull yourself up by your bootstraps nigga yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's pussy shit on that note, dog, niggas got all serious with the final sentiment. God damn, nigga. Look up, nigga. Relax. I ain't looking look up, up shit. Nigga. I'm going to continue on with my head down and shit. That's, uh, that's normal for you, though. We know that. It's fucking not normal, nigga. I'm yeah. the most inquisitive motherfucker down here. So you said lying. with your head down, bro. That motherfucker too heavy in the first place. You can't even lift it all the way up in your neck. Nigga, that, my head you, is the lightest part of me, nigga. Shit, it's the smallest part of me. <laughs> shit. I'm like, the only nigga down here with a little head. Y'all niggas is the big head, niggas. Nigga, your neck, I though. Your neck. <laughs> the lack of neck don't make you bend all the way back. Nigga. Hey, the lack of neck makes it more stable, nigga. <laughs> it won't Less wiggle you... roll, nigga. <laughs> it won't let you go all well, the way back. Motherfucker, I heard all the fat jokes. They got to combat you... them shits. The only one that still fuck with me, though, is the motherfuckers laughing when they told me that sandwich was my word at the spelling bee, nigga. Some bullshit. Anyway, dog, on that note, dog, we about to get up out of here. <laughs> 
<laughs> my final sentiment is to leave the people with dog for real. We on the serious note, I guess, since we on all this serious shit. There's Look a lot up, of nigga. there's a lot of things going on on the earth today and shit, dog. Both physically and mentally. So uh, take care of yourself and each other, nigga. That's all I can say, dog, for real. Cause yeah, time probably running short. A lot of niggas dying and shit already. Rest in peace to the niggas who died since the last time we was it's on like here. COVID coming back. We'll shit, that motherfucker ain't never went nowhere. You say about to be locked down again, though. Oh shit. PPP. <laughs> they said that for real? Hell no. Nah, they ain't locking this bitch down no more. They didn't figure that shit out. Tell me this bitch gonna be locked down again. Uh, well, I'm remote anyway, so I don't Mark my words. <laughs> Mark your words. Oh shit. Nigga Diamonds and shit. Nigga Diamonds. <laughs> we out here, dog. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, <laughs> dog. New, <laughs> new episode of the Shine vs. Everybody podcast dropping tomorrow night, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on eblockradio.com. New episode of Beers Bourbon Whiskey podcast dropping Wednesday night on everybodylovesbbw.com. Dog, make sure you check that out. Buy some, uh, buy some shit. We got some glasses, motherfucking uh, shot, not shot glasses, uh, beer, beer glasses and shit. Hats, t-shirts, all kind of shit, dog. So check us out. That's it, dog. We'll see y'all niggas next week, man. Till the next time. You already know what it is. The Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet. Earth, cuz. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show, dog. Got my man Angry Man in the building. Do it till you're satisfied. <laughs> Got my man Monk Money <laughs> holding it down. <laughs> uh, look up, niggas. <laughs> this nigga, he did that shit in Barry White voice, too. <laughs> do it. No. Do it. Do it till you're satisfied. Do it till you're satisfied. <laughs> And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis, man, holding it down live for the 48205, man. Peace out, y'all. Damn, Q. Baby, you did that. You ain't never been on E Block, bitch. You too excited. (laughs) Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. The live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet. Earth, cuss. Straight from the E Block Radio live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show.